Yeah, as I was saying, uh, still lenalidomide refractoriness is an unmet need because most of those patients uh, are receiving LEN until progression. So it means that all the LEN-based triplet cannot be used. So you have to treat patients either with proteasome inhibitors or with anti-CD38, but some patients may be also refractory to anti-CD38 monoclonal antibodies. So this is adding uh, some difficulties uh, on the top. Uh, so for sure we can rely on new, new drugs, so immunotherapies uh, um, such as uh, bispecific, CAR T that are moving forward. Uh, we can rely on uh, Belamaf, this is back on stage in triplet combination that have been recently published, or we can rely on PI plus anti-CD38 monoclonal antibodies in those patients who are not refractory to anti-CD38 monoclonal antibodies. So of course the treatment is chosen uh, on the patient, uh, on the um, different risk factors, uh, refractoriness to land, but also age, uh, other risk factors, uh, perspective, uh, objective for the treatment of the patients. So uh, in comparison to some years ago, I think that now we are in a better situation. However, still some patients uh, are suffering uh, uh, for a reduced uh, survival outcomes.